Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel. Remember to subscribe below, give us a like and share. Thank you. Today, we have a special collection on salamanders. And these are exotic amphibians pet. And they are getting more and more popular in the world for several reasons. They are generally easy to care for. They have basic housing requirements and they are incredibly interesting animals just to watch. There are over 600 different species and types of salamanders and nymphs. And like most or all amphibians, they spend most if not all of their life in the water. Salamanders, they have much in common with nymphs, but there are also important distinctions. All newts are salamanders, but not all salamanders are newts. Newts have webbed feet and paddle-like tails that are ideal for living in the water. But salamanders are most adapted to live on the land, with longer, rounded tails and developed toes that are evolved from efficiently digging in the soil. And in general, the salamanders spend most of the time in the water are referred to as nymphs. They actually make good pets, both nymphs and salamanders. And if you would like to know more about them here, you will get to know and understand them more before making a decision whether to own one. While nymphs and salamanders make great pets, from an observatory point of view, they are not partial to being handled and can be described as hands-off pets. They have extremely dedicated, dedicated skins that can easily be damaged with handling and cause potential infections. They are generally easy animals to care for, but they have specific requirements because they spend most of their time in the tank in the water. They need to have very clean water in their tank that is free from any pollutants and the water temperature cannot be too warm or it can result in a weakened immune systems. It is also important to note that they are mostly nocturnal, so you only see them active at night. If you want an interactive and cuddly type, they are not ideal. Thank you.